Urban Outdoor Adventures, teaching anglers and outdoor enthusiasts when, where, and how. Urban Outdoor Adventures, sponsored by Prince Craft Boats. The more you know, the better we look. Great tip here for you guys. If ever you're passing a boat with a naked woman on it, get your binoculars out. <laughs> you probably guessed this is not a real tip. Here are some bloopers from season one. All right, couldn't resist, sorry. I want to get a picture too, so... Oh, you gotta flip Wait. him around. Yeah. Uh. You got it? <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh. Okay. <laughs> so I want to pick it up. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with some good friends of mine. We've got, I uh, forgot the names. Um, <laughs> Justin, right? Yeah. Riley, Emily, okay. Here with some good friends of mine. Got Justin, Ryan, R <laughs> Riley. Jesus. <laughs> All right. I'm here with some good friends of mine. We've got Ryan. Oh, <laughs> hey, I keep going. You gotta put them in a different order. I'm here with some good friends of mine. Justin, Riley, and Emma. We're gonna be fishing for some carp up here today. And uh, let's leave it right there a minute because I didn't quite plan on going any further than that. Hi everyone, it's 5.30 in the morning on a Sunday morning. Uh, okay, just keep it going, I just keep it. That was pretty crappy. It's too freaking early for this. Hi everyone, it's 5.30 on a Sunday morning. I dragged my good friend Jen here out to do some salmon fish with her there. Right. <laughs> Okay, we're going to be in the marshes in a minute. <laughs> yeah, he's there. This feels like a better one. This feels like a better one. Fishing at, we have counters on the downriggers that show which depth you're fishing. Once you get a, a, a pattern of where those fish are hitting, keep your lines there. And uh, you should be able to stay on fish that way. I have no idea where I was going with that. Like, I don't even think you know what you're talking about. This looks prime over here. <laughs> now we haven't had a thing since the first muskie of the day, 18,000 hours ago. We're in the sleet and snow. Maybe we should go to a different place that doesn't look any good. Yeah. That's all you've been saying all day long. Looks good here, looks good here. Yeah, that's great. There's no fish in the thing, though. <laughs> but it's a beautiful fish, it's though. It's great. Right? Awesome. Exactly. Disgusting. Okay, we got a few there, so that should work. Okay, I so got snotted on my left arm. Oh! Slimes! Came back out after uh, a huge rainstorm came through with thunder and lightning, and we absolutely got drenched, didn't we? <laughs> we Which is did. why you can see we're. Uh, I actually got a little tip here for you. If you wear quick dry pants, don't wear cotton underwear because <laughs> my crotch is so soaking wet right now. <laughs> Obviously, this is not a real tip of the week. Here are some bloopers from season two. <laughs> okay. Ew. We should have thought that through, eh? Yeah. Wait, maybe bottom. Big one? No, I think I got bottom. <laughs> <laughs> it looked good, though, Johnny. It Johnny's. looked good there. <laughs> looked pretty good. <laughs>
Welcome to the show, Ray. Uh, oh, Ray. <laughs> Wake up. <laughs> Thanks, Chuck. Yeah. I'm looking yeah. forward to Thanks. this. Save. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing like fishing at night when you can't see a friggin' thing. What the hell? <laughs> what happened to the forceps, by the way? Uh, Are they in the water here somewhere? Are they in your pocket? What did you do after you left the fishing? I have no idea. I probably dropped them. There they are. Did you right where you left them? Oh yeah. What a f***ing mess. <laughs> this is what you call it a day. <laughs> it's a disaster. Yeah, I'm going to bed. I'll let the cameraman have the rest of the night off. Nice fish! Oh, you oh. f***ing... He dropped it! Oh my god. Want me to grab him? Yeah. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> That's a blooper. Okay. <laughs> that <dude> flew, <laughs> flew off. <laughs> so I guess one important thing we shouldn't throw over each other's lines. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Like a voiceover. Yeah, yeah and what? Before I, <laughs> I, I put my hand, I get burnt. Yeah, if it's not, if it's not. Um, Ants biting you. Yes, I'm getting on. I'm getting my hands burned. Okay. Cut. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, blooper segment, right? Yeah. One good uh, point here that John made. He looked down at the graph and said to me, nah, "Anyway, that's bullshit." Start that again. <laughs> I, I didn't even know where I was going with that, so I just started again. Okay. Okay. Camera's right on the uh, reel there, Dan. Yeah. I'm just gonna whoa! Oh, geez. <laughs> Good catch. Nice save there. We've seen piles of garbage, coffee cups, crisp packets. Oh, crisp packets. People won't even know what a crisp packet is, will they? We're looking for steelhead. It's late fall, and uh, we'll get back to you when we get into some of these. Uh, yeah, f that. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> well, I must be reeling in your line then. Right? Because I definitely have a fish on here. Oh, you do? So yeah. maybe it's on that one then. It's on here. Well, we don't know which rod it's on, but we've got a fish on here, so... <laughs> oh, it came off. Huh. Little bugger. Annihilated my tube. It's a little slippery in here, right? <laughs> I didn't even know I had a fish on. Oh, sorry, bud. Right. Boat. <laughs> so wet. <laughs> he's in. The, he's in the line as well. <laughs> Down there. Yeah. And uh, what we're doing, is we're rigging it weedless. So what you do is you take your weight, just tuck it right up inside. Wow, it's coming in. And then we'll just. Uh, Got a bit of a storm moving in on us here, <laughs> so we'll, we'll, we'll make this a quick lesson. <laughs> As the rain's okay, coming. let's cut that and get the <laughs> out of here. <laughs> oh, it's another rockfish. Oh, it wasn't moving. That's so weird. That's two rockfish for you today.